people about the incident that took place in Clarendon, where it is said that the owner of Footprints Funeral Home was accidentally shot and killed during an altercation, may have some different type of news panda so me and our people. Now, allegations are that Sherwin Williams, the owner of Footprints Funeral Home, chopped the man before Pai Pai happened. So the man we shoot him, them say him chop the man pan him finger, him finger almost chop off, and at them time the gunshot ring out. Remember me say allegations. And it is also said that the incident took place at his sister's supermarket. It wasn't at his business place. So them say him left and go down his sister business place because allegations are that he found out he was being robbed by the sister. Now people, me get some information as me say. I'm going to read, make no hear, and just like how it is on the paper, I saw me going to read it, make everybody hear what it has say. Member people, allegations. They are mixing up the businesses, Juba. It is said that the dead man was the owner of Footprints, but his sister was left to manage it. However, them say the man found out he was being robbed by the sister, so him got down at the sister business place and a close it up with customers inside during a quarrel with his sister. The brother-in-law, who them say is a soldier, stepped in to defend his wife and the deceased was not having it, so they got into an altercation and the deceased shot the in-law and Pai Pai happened, however it happened. This are not just now sinting according to sources. Cause the deceased even went and opened another funeral home called Rising Footprints. The source further stated that the deceased took the sister's name of the documents for footprints before he died, so she dropped down when she here and was at the hospital, no know if them admit her. The source also stated that after the incident, the in law was at the hospital acting senile. Them say him namad, him just a pretend. Overall, it is a sad situation. Very sad for true. And this man left a whole lot of people a moan. A lot of people a cried tears for Mr. Sherwin Williams. People talk so good about this man. May I tell you, I don't see one bad comment pertaining to Mr. Williams. Everybody have something good to say about this man. So again, may I say, may his soul rest in peace. Yes, man. And condolences goes out to the families, friends, well wishers, whoever you may be. My condolences goes out. It's sad for you know, I saw the man losing life. Things do happen, but some things nothing happen like all this now. Well, I tell you, very sad people. Me get the article two days ago, but you know, me just make the know say, I that go on. So leave your thoughts in the comment section. Big up, I'm out.